what's up vlog it's your girl bare fit so in today's vlog we're gonna be doing a little bit of shopping for the holla zays y'all today is november the 22nd and i have quite a bit of things to do first things first i need to go find some specific burgundy maroon um Mm, my perfume smells so good the perfume i got from burlington the orange one smells so good i need to find some specific uh orange not orange burgundy ornaments um for our christmas tree we're doing a special christmas tree i'm gonna show you guys a inspo picture right here i'm super excited for that tree um so i'm in the plaza that has all the things and i'm about to go get get to shopping and then i have to go buy some food items for thanksgiving thanksgiving is tomorrow oh that water is good but yeah anyways i just turned the ac off in the car so i need to get out but let's go i'm so excited all right let's go i'm gonna go to bed bath and beyond first because i feel like they might have a good throw blanket i'm looking for and i have a coupon with them or a gift card so we're gonna hop in there first. Oh, they are closing. Oh my goodness. Well, I guess we're not going in there. That store is closing, child. Makes sense, because nobody's hardly in there. All right, let me hop in Ross real quick. See what they have. I'm gonna do Ross, TJ Maxx, all the things. Oh wow, that's cool. I would definitely get this for somebody. Twenty-five dollars, not bad. So here's some cute little Christmas sets and gifts. I don't think I need any of these right now. So right now I'm not like Christmas gift shopping. This is cute. My mom would like this a lot. Oh, she would really like that. Yeah, I'm not really shopping for gifts, so. I'm gonna try to stay away gifts but I could look at some home decor oh my gosh how cute is this it's only $12 too I might get that for my sister that'll be cute in her house it's kind of small it's really for jewelry but I don't think a purse is gonna be able to fit on there I do want one of these how much is this? Oh, it's only eight dollars. It's pretty big. I have one. It's just small. It's already broken. Goes with theme. They're so cute. I want a candle holder. Oh, so cool. That I can use every year. I want a candle holder. Let me see. It's a big red one. Something that's not going to be hard to store, but this is really, really cute to put your candles in. It's just for a really big candle, and my candles are not that size. My candles are about this size. So, I mean, this is kind of cute. We'll see. $8? I think this should be like $5.99. That's $8. All right, let me go to the next aisle. Oh, I think it's safe to say that I need a cart now because this little thing is full. So I'm gonna go get a new cart. All right, so that was very successful and I'm super happy about that because I found some good stuff. Obviously, I will show you guys when I get home. So Bed Bath & Beyond is closed. I got the throw blanket I needed for the living room. I now need to get those Christmas ornaments. I don't know if I want to try home goods. I guess I should try it just for the sake of trying it because it's right behind me. And then I want to go into TJ Maxx if I don't find it in there. I'm also looking for curtains. I decided I want to also do 
change out the curtains because the curtains we have up we have them up all year long so now would be a perfect time to change them so yeah i'm gonna hop into home goods hopefully i find something very much something i might stop in ulta just to see what deals they have so that when it's time for me to christmas shop for people i could kind of know what i'm looking for but yeah so other than that i'm having a great little day solo day i love shopping by myself to be honest because i get to just get in and get out do what i gotta do but yeah i'm going to go ahead and if this person would have just let me win um oh five below what could i find in there candy uh, i'm gonna go to home goods which is right here i like this plaza but i don't shop in here enough because i'm always at burlington but i am here today so it's all that matters so let's hop in here real quick when i was parking all these birds were like literally in this parking space and i feel like they are mad at me because i just parked over whatever food they were eating so they're just all like literally sitting behind the car i guess mad because i took their lunch but they're just all literally behind me look 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 they're all mad look at them i don't want to open the, the car door right now but hold on they're, like if you can see them through the mirror they're all just um the bushes mad because i am on top of their lunch too bad <laughs> I'm getting a little delirious. The two stores, Five Below and Home Goods. Ah, uh, obsessed with Oreo, a dunk set. Oh, this is for my husband right here. He actually is obsessed with Oreos, and it has a little, it has little tongs. Knowing him, he'd rather use a fork anyways, but it's cute. Got us some new pajama pants. Oh look, the Home Alone t-shirt. I would never buy this for my kids. Like, what's even in the ingredients? Look at that. Horrible. What is FDNC blue? F Red dye 40 is horrible for kids, y'all. If y'all don't know that, stop giving your kids food coloring. Because that ain't good for ya. All right, so I can definitely say I slept. I've been sleeping on Home Goods because it's got some nice things. Only thing about it is some of these particular things you can find at like Ross, TJ Maxx, Burlington for a little bit less. Like all their throw blankets are 20 and up and I'd be getting my throw blankets for like 15 bucks. But other than that, I only got a few things. One thing I'm missing is curtains. Um, got some popcorn, hot cocoa, a little cute little frame to put our new picture and then 
that little mantle thing. I was just looking at this on Amazon. This is a lamp, y'all. I should like it. It's pretty cute. So this is the size I need. It's just the wrong color. So I didn't find anything in there besides a gingerbread mold to make some brownies. And after that, we got a little snack. <laughs> Anyways, I'm about to go into Ulta real quick and get my free gift. All right, so, so I love shopping at Ulta. I got a free gift that I'm about to use to get a, sh a concealer from Tarte. I feel like this would be my ideal. This is so cute. How cute. Oh my gosh, y'all. Look at this. That's so cute. All right, y'all. So I'm at Walmart now, getting some ingredients to make some Thanksgiving food. I'm super tired. It is now 3:30, so I've been out since 10:45. About four hours of shopping. So after this, I'm going home. It's been a good day. All right, y'all, so I'm back home. Let me turn on my tree. There we go. So we put the tree up. We haven't done anything else besides put the tree up yet because I'm still looking for the ornaments. But I'm gonna go back to Hobby Lobby on Friday. Anywho, I'm about to show y'all, hold on. I just got up from a nap. I'm about to show y'all everything that I got so I can organize them so that we can get it all done together. All right, so let's do a quick haul of everything that I got, all the important stuff anyways. So at Ulta, I'm gonna do it really quick y'all. At Ulta, I just got the Shape Tape Concealer. That was a free gift for becoming a Diamond member. So that's just a new status that I got for shopping there so much. So I got this Shape Tape Concealer that I'm gonna try out in another video. And then I got the new Morphe Tease the Season Artistry Palette, and it has a lot of nice colors. I'm gonna be doing some makeup videos before this year's over because I haven't done one in a long time. So this was 40% off, so I got this palette for only $16, which is a steal for Morphe, and it's only 30 and it's 35 colors. So I'm super excited for that. From the Nordstrom Rack Store, I simply got this gingerbread mold. I'm gonna be using this. On our vlog channel for me and my husband we're gonna tr i'm gonna use it to make um a brownie and we're gonna decorate it like a gingerbread so that'll be a nice little video that we'll be doing on our vlog channel so make sure you follow us because we are doing vlogmas um this year so the jared's official link down below so he's gonna be excited to see that more stuff for the channel i got that caramel popcorn that's for vlogmas 
these from TJ Maxx. It's a set of four, but I'm going to actually return this. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go back and get a bigger pack of these at at home. Or is it at home? Either at home or Hobby Lobby. I'm going to return these because this was $12 and I can get more for that. This is from Home Goods. Food. I got some smoked paprika. Something simple. And then some hot chocolate powder. That's also for Vlogmas. Okay, from TJ Maxx, I got this Christmas countdown. Also going to use this for Vlogmas. And it's just a treat with the numbers inside. This was $10. It could have been less than that, but I think it would be really nice for us to start up our Vlogmas with this every day. So that's also for Vlogmas. Then I also picked up these fun puns joke cards to do it for like a quick little date night to make each other laugh and it just has some puns on it one of them says guess what you can do with a broken pencil and it says nothing it's pointless so anyways puns if you like puns if you like that type of humor then you probably enjoy something like this i'll probably try to find the link if it's on amazon for y'all to get it as well from five below also for our vlogmas i got us some matching little christmas shirts from home alone I think this was really nice and you know nobody ever wears home alone stuff and i really love watching home alone every holiday so i got a matching shirt for that so we can wear it to like a christmas party or something and then i also got us the matching um pajama bottoms to you know take some pictures and stuff which i know my husband will appreciate because he likes stuff like that so that's from five below from ross i bought these two perfume pictures that have the chanel perfume i think that would be really nice to you know add to the room so i got two of those i don't know if i'm going to keep both of them but we're going to try it out and see how i like it i'm going to rearrange this room just a little bit tonight just a little bit all right let's get the other bags let's move the next up from five below just got some candy canes to go in our candy jar i got the starburst flavor and some airhead flavor simple little things like from home goods i got this frame to put our christmas photo we've been slacking really bad with taking christmas photos so i'm just gonna make sure we get back on that from tj maxx i got two new purses i have this purse already in gold so i'm really excited to have the black one so there's the gold one that i've had for about a year now and now we have it in black so that's gonna be really cute together i thought that was a really good investment originally i got the gold one from marshall's last year i got the yeah last year around this time so now we've got it in black as well so i'm gonna put that on the perfume rack soon and then I also picked up another sparkly bag, which, which is crazy because I've been in the, on the hunt for a nice sparkly bag and I finally found one. So here's this one. It's so, so cute. Perfect for the... Ah, uh, I knew they forgot something on it. I knew it. I, sh I had a feeling in the store that she forgot it on there, but it didn't even, it didn't even make the sound but i knew it like in my heart i just knew it something was stuck on there so i have to go back and get this taken off which is fine because i have to go return what's going on focus so i have to go back because they forgot to take off the center and it's on the bag it's not just on the tag it's like on the bag so that's annoying and it didn't even work I don't know if I should be telling y'all that, but it did not even work. And this is from TJ Maxx. So we got this cute little bag. Perfect for a holiday get ready with me video. So I'm going to go back on Friday morning. Here's the receipts. I spent $125 at TJ Maxx. So I'm definitely going to go and get that removed and return from five below. I got this heatless hair curler i've been wanting this for a very long time so yeah i'll show you how to use that in a video one day also got a foot massager because my feet be hurting so I'm definitely gonna be using that soon and i got my husband some holiday socks that i'm probably gonna put in his stocking stuffer 
And then I picked up a few um, liquid black eyeliners because I ran out. So I just picked up three of them from Five Below. They're $1.75 a piece. So I've got some back up. Next, I got from TJ Maxx again. We got these cute, 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 cute burgundy um, Christmas trees. And they're soft velvet with a nice texture. These were both $12 a piece and I got two of them. But I'm super excited for these. I think my husband's gonna like these a lot because it goes with the new vibe color scheme we got going on. Right, almost done. This is from Ross. I got this little Joy LED candle, faux candle thing, which we can keep forever because it's plastic. So that's really cute. That way I don't have to use my regular glass ones. And this goes with our cranberry theme. And yeah, and they take batteries and this was $12. Then I got some coffee cups, coffee to go cups. I'm gonna take these out to work because I drink coffee a lot. These were only $4.99. Um, then I got just some regular um, pants hangers because I always need that for my skirts. So I just got a pack of two and they were $3.99 each. And they have five, so they be taxing on these because like regular hangers, you could buy like 30 of them for $5, $11. But you get only five of these for four dollars so maybe taxing but it is what it is i always need these for my skirts because i like to hang up all of my clothes oh this one i'm super excited for because i got one of these again now i have this in three colors i have the pink one i'll show y'all later y'all know this already though i have a pink one a green one now i have it in blue so i'm super excited and it's a really nice blue too so yeah this is from ross and this was only twelve dollars so i'm super excited that i got this because i like these purses and yeah i'm super excited for that i really went in on purses today because yeah i got this little thing either i'm going to use it for purses or i'm going to use it for actual jewelry we'll see because i mean I, the purse will have to be really really short but i do have a few mini purses that will fit on this but if not i'm going to use it for my bangles because i really want to get into wearing a lot of more bracelets and bangles so i got that oh my gosh i did not realize how many purses i bought i might return like two of them because yeah we'll see um i got some mittens with our theme i do not i promise y'all I was going in in Ross. I got this purse at Ross. It's an Aldo bag. I think it's very cute and it fits a lot of things. I don't have anything like it and I don't have any really like white purses like that. So this is a nice balance. Oh, I didn't realize this was $30, but it makes sense. It's an Aldo bag, but it's a nice size. I could easily fit like my camera in it if I need to vlog. It comes with a strap if I have to put it on. I don't know. I like top handle bags that you hold up here. That's that. That's from Aldo. Super excited for this. And this is the last purse I bought. So I bought in total one, two, three, four, four purses, five purses today. And then I bought this white and black one. I thought I really like the contrast of this one. Um, it gives a Chanel vibe, but that's not why I bought it. I bought it because it was black and white and I wear those colors a lot. So this was only 14 bucks and it's cute. I love the gold chain. I, know I love me some gold, but I think I'm done for buying black and white purses. Like I need to get into other colors. I only have one orange and stuff like that, but I'm winding down the last bag. I got this table runner. It was on clearance and it's a nice fall style. It was only $5. I bought it because it was fall inspired. So next fall, we'll definitely be using this on the table. All right. And then I bought this also for when I do change it up and it's just some sheer win window panels. And this nice um, little pattern. I put this up um, around New Year's because, you know, it'll symbolize, you know, freshness and things. And then lastly, I guess I didn't buy as much stuff as I really think about. Like, when I really think about it, it's a lot of little stuff. And then lastly, I got this throw blanket. This was from Ross. It was only $12. And it's a nice pattern, similar to everything. Poinsettias, all the things. And it's a nice, perfect cranberry color that i need so i'm gonna get this bed out of the way so i can move my perfume rack over do i want to do that tonight yes i do want to do it so that when i need to record on saturday i can just 
get done. So I'm about to move some stuff around. Let me get back on here once I am ready to show y'all what's next. 